the North London Derby, a fixture steeped in history, passion and an unquenchable thirst for bragging rights. This is not just any match, it's a battle that has been fought for generations. When Arsenal and Tottenham Hotspur clash, the football world watches with bated breath. The stakes are high and the atmosphere is electric. It's a rivalry that ignites emotions, divides families and leaves an indelible mark on the Premier League season. The tension is palpable and the excitement is unmatched. On this day, the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium was a cauldron of anticipation, the air thick with the scent of rivalry. Fans poured in, each one hoping to witness history. The home fans, a sea of white and blue, roared their team forward, their voices merging into a powerful chorus of support. While the travelling Arsenal faithful, a splash of red and white amidst the throng, sang with unwavering belief. Their chants echoed through the stadium, a testament to their loyalty. For 90 minutes, the two teams would battle for supremacy, for local pride, for a victory that would echo through the streets of North London. Every pass, every tackle, every goal was a moment of pure drama. This was more than just a game. It was a statement of intent a declaration of dominance, a story that would be told and retold for years to come. The opening exchanges were a tense affair, both teams understandably wary of making a costly mistake. Every pass, every touch of the ball was measured, as neither side wanted to give an inch. The atmosphere in the stadium was electric, with fans on the edge of their seats, holding their breath with every move. The midfield became a battleground, tackles flying in with ferocity. Players were not holding back, each challenge more intense than the last. The physicality of the game was evident, as both teams fought tooth and nail to gain control of the centre of the pitch. Chances were few and far between, the tension palpable on the pitch and in the stands. Every missed opportunity was met with groans from the crowd and the frustration was visible on the players' faces. The pressure was mounting and it was clear that a single moment of brilliance or a mistake could change the course of the game. Arsenal, with their fluid passing game, looked to control possession, probing for an opening in the Tottenham defence. Their strategy was clear. Keep the ball, wear down the opposition, and wait for the perfect moment to strike. The players moved the ball with precision, trying to find gaps in the Spurs' defensive line. The likes of Bukayo Saka and Gabriel Jesus threatened to break free, their pace and trickery causing problems for the Spurs' backline. Every time they got the ball, there was a sense of anticipation. Their quick feet and sharp movements kept the Tottenham defenders on high alert, knowing that any lapse in concentration could be costly. Tottenham, on the other hand, adopted a more direct approach, looking to utilise the aerial prowess of Harry Kane and the pace of Son Hung Min on the counter-attack. Their game plan was straightforward. Get the ball forward quickly and exploit any spaces left by the Arsenal defence. Kane's ability to win headers and Sun's speed made them a constant threat. The first half remained goalless, but the stage was set for a thrilling second period. The fans, though anxious, were hopeful for more action after the break. Both teams had shown glimpses of their potential and it was clear that the second half would be a test of endurance strategy and nerves. The second half began with renewed purpose, both teams sensing the importance of the occasion. Tottenham, roared on by their home support, started brightly, putting the Arsenal defence under pressure. However, they found a formidable obstacle in Arsenal goalkeeper Aaron Ramsdale. Ramsdale, in inspired form, produced a string of outstanding saves to keep Tottenham at bay. 
His agility, reflexes and composure were a sight to behold, frustrating the Spurs attackers and galvanising his own team. Time and again, Ramsdale was called upon to deny Tottenham. His performance a testament to his growing reputation as one of the Premier League's finest young goalkeepers. His heroics would prove crucial in the final outcome of the match. As the game approached the hour mark, the tension reached fever pitch. Both teams were locked in a fierce battle with neither side willing to give an inch. The fans were on the edge of their seats, their faces a mix of hope and anxiety. The deadlock was finally broken and it was a goal worthy of winning any game. The stadium erupted in a cacophony of cheers and applause as the fans celebrated the breakthrough they had been desperately waiting for. Arsenal's Thomas Partey, who had been quietly influential throughout the match, produced a moment of individual brilliance that sent the Arsenal fans into raptures. His composure and vision had been evident all game, but this was something special. Receiving the ball just outside the penalty area, Partey unleashed an unstoppable right-footed shot that flew past the outstretched hand of the Tottenham goalkeeper and into the back of the net. The precision and power of the shot left everyone in awe. It was a goal of the highest quality, a combination of power, precision and sheer audacity. The technique required to execute such a shot was extraordinary and Partey made it look effortless. The Arsenal players mobbed Partey, their celebrations a mixture of joy and relief. They knew the significance of this goal, not just for the match, but for their season. The goal had changed the complexion of the match, giving Arsenal a crucial lead and putting Tottenham on the back foot. The momentum had shifted and Arsenal looked to capitalise on their newfound advantage. Section 5. Holding the Fort Arsenal's Defensive Resilience The goal seemed to galvanise Arsenal, who defended their lead with discipline and determination. The backline, well marshalled by the commanding presence of Gabriel Magalhaes, stood firm in the face of Tottenham's onslaught. William Saliba, alongside Gabriel, was a rock at the back for Arsenal. His reading of the game, his tackling and his aerial prowess were all top-notch, effectively nullifying the threat posed by Harry Kane. The introduction of Ben White for the impressive Oleksandr Zinchenko added further steel to the Arsenal defence. White slotted in seamlessly, making crucial interceptions and clearances to preserve his team's slender advantage. Section 6. The Emirates Stadium. A cauldron of noise. The atmosphere inside the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium was electric, with both sets of fans creating an incredible din. The home supporters, despite their team trailing, continued to cheer on their heroes, urging them to find an equaliser. The Arsenal fans, sensing a famous victory, were in full voice their chants and songs reverberating around the stadium. The noise they generated was deafening, creating an intimidating atmosphere for the home team. The roar that greeted Partey's goal was something special. The away end erupted in a cacophony of noise, their joy and relief palpable. It was a moment that those present would never forget. Section 7. A Statement Victory Arsenal's Title Credentials This victory was a significant moment in Arsenal's season. It was a statement win that sent a message to the rest of the league. Arsenal are genuine title contenders. The win extended Arsenal's lead at the top of the Premier League table, underlining their impressive start to the campaign. It also demonstrated their ability to grind out results in tough away fixtures, a quality that is essential for any team with aspirations of winning the league. The performance was even more impressive,
considering that Arsenal were missing several key players through injury. It showed the strength in depth of Mikel Arteta's squad and the manager's tactical acumen. Section 8. Conte's Concerns Spurs left searching for answers. For Tottenham, the defeat was a major setback. It was their second consecutive loss in the Premier League, leaving them with work to do if they are to challenge for a top four finish. Manager Antonio Conte cut a frustrated figure on the touchline, his side struggling to break down a resolute Arsenal defence. The lack of creativity and cutting edge in the final third will be a major concern for the Italian. The defeat also raised questions about Tottenham's ability to compete with the Premier League's elite. They have now lost their last four matches against Arsenal, a worrying sign for Conte and his team. Section 9. The Road Ahead. A promising outlook for Arsenal. Arsenal's victory over Tottenham was a memorable occasion for the club and its supporters. It was a performance full of character, quality and resilience, one that showcased the significant progress the team has made under Mikel Arteta. The win will give the players immense confidence as they enter a crucial period of the season. With the Premier League title race wide open, Arsenal have a real opportunity to achieve something special this year. The future looks bright for Arsenal Football Club. With a talented young squad, a shrewd manager and a renewed sense of belief, the Gunners are well-placed to challenge for major honours 